Hey you guys, what's up? My name is Megan. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a little try on slash slash um, first impressions of the new Bite Beauty lipstick. I oh, just dropped them all. <laughs> I picked up four shades of the Power Move Soft Matte Lip. So that's what we're going to be trying on today. If that sounds fun to you, be sure to stay tuned. Before you leave, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so that you'll be notified of all my future uploads. And if you like this style of video, don't forget to give this a thumbs up. It'd be really great if I could talk. I haven't done a lipstick like try on in a really long time. So everybody say a quick prayer or a moment of silence for my lips. It will be appreciated. First shade I'm gonna try on is Palmello. This is the packaging, super beautiful, so sleek. It's not gonna focus, of course, but super beautiful, really sleek, um, matte on the outside, really nice. I love that it's black. This is the shade. Uh, I don't even know if it like works for you guys, me getting close or not, but this is a shade. I decided to pick these up after watching my, uh, my friend. <laughs> she feels like my friend because I love her. Um, Tachi's video reviewing these, her sponsored video. She had a code for 20% off. After watching her review and seeing my good friend Taylor pick these up and love them, I pulled the trigger and I bought them. Okay, that's what I did. So Palmello is the first one we're going to be trying out. This looks like a super, super pinky color. So I'm not sure how much I love this. Oh, oh, she pink. She pink. I don't know how I feel about this shade, you guys. What do you think? What do you feel? How do you feel? Mm, I don't really know. This might be, and this was the one that I was really on the fence about because I was like, man, this is like pretty pink for my comfort zone, but I wanted to try it out. So this might be one that I would return or see if someone else would like, but yeah, hmm. I don't know. Maybe with like the a different look, I'd like it better, but I think it might be too pink for my personal taste. <laughs> The next shade we're gonna try on is Tamarind. It looks like this super pretty, like warm, gingery brown. My friend Angelica over on IG actually got this shade and she was applying it in her stores yesterday. And I was like, oh my gosh, that is so beautiful. I hope that's one of the shades that I picked up. Like, thank goodness it was. Yeah, this is what it looks like. It looks stunning. Let's hope that it's a good color for me as well. I will say these are applying really nicely, like not too slippery or anything like that. So I'm into that. I really think that I love this shade. The shade actually goes super nicely with the look we have on today. Mm -hmm. Okay, definitely love this one. Again, it's the shade uh, Tamarind, I don't, or Tamarind. <laughs> I don't know if I'm saying that right, you guys. If you know me, then you know English is hard for me. And it's my first language, but I just, you know. Okay, two down, two to go. This is actually going to probably be a pretty short video, really. Uh, the next one I think I'm going to try is Ginger Malt. This looks like it's going to be a deeper shade, which... I kind of decluttered a lot of my deeper shaded lipsticks, so that's why I picked this one up. But it looks like a really beautiful, like, brown. I hope it's, like, a more on, like, the cool tone side. 
But yeah, and look at this little, I don't even know if you guys can see because I film on my iPhone, but this cute little bee on there. That's so pretty. I probably should have photographed all these before putting my fucking lips on them, but <laughs> here we are. Oh yeah, that shade's gonna be gorge. Okay, got a little bit carried away there at the top, which is okay. Uh, I'm just gonna take like a little fine brush and kind of like blend it out to how I like it. Yeah, that's a super beautiful shade and it's not like too dark that I feel like I won't wear it. This is going to be an insanely gorgeous fall shade, I think. And so far, like they do feel really comfortable, like not super drying like that good in the middle feel. This was the shade again, Ginger Malt. Really liked that one. Super gorgeous. But yeah, so far feels pretty good. The last shade I have is uh, Sesame. This one looks like it's gonna be a really pretty like pale nude. Let me wipe off what I got on. Surprisingly, my lips are holding up pretty well. I will be doing a scrub tonight for sure, but they're holding up pretty well. So this is the sesame shade. It's like a super pretty nude. Maybe has a little bit of a peachy tone to it. We'll see. Got on the outside a little bit. Okay, this shade is gorgeous. This is like a my lips but better kind of shade I really feel like. Oof, this one is pretty. Again, and this one is sesame, so really pretty. Loving, honestly, all of these except for Except for this pomelo shade, I really just think it's going to be a lot brighter than what I would use. But I feel like maybe if I did it with like a deep liner, then I could make it work. Uh, or do like some kind of ombre effect. Just like has it have it as like a lightening shade type of deal. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I really love this shade though. These three are definitely winners for me. The Sesame, Ginger Malt, and Tamarind. Those were my favorites. And yeah, I mean, so far, obviously I have not had it on that long, but it feels like really comfortable on the lips. I'll be interested to see how long wearing this is. I will probably update you guys in the description just because we're gonna be in and out of the house moving forward today, so I won't have time to check back in, but I will update you guys in the description how it wear, how it wore, how I feel about them. Uh, like I mentioned, this is just a first impressions because obviously I just opened them. I don't feel comfortable doing reviews after using products one time. I like to really try it out for at least a week or two before I'm like, here are my full thoughts. Especially because these are so expensive, I would wanna make sure that I tried them out, knew how I felt before I'm like, yeah, Go buy this $30 lipstick, you know? Um, Tati recommended them though, so I think that speaks for itself, kind of. But yeah, really loving these. Let me know if you picked some of them up. If so, what shades did you get? How are you feeling about them, etc. This will literally be the shortest video on my channel right now, but that's okay. I hope you guys like this, and if you did, be sure to let me know by giving this video a big like. And yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. I hope that you have an incredible weekend and I will see you in the next one.